So you're on your favorite streaming site trying to watch some free content and these sites are just plagued with full screen adverts, lots of pop-ups. We can see these large video based adverts and it just makes the navigation process very, very difficult because as you're trying to click on something or move around, you're just constantly shown different adverts. And if you refresh the page and we can now see we have some floating adverts really just taking up most of the screen and it just makes the entire browsing experience, especially when you're trying to watch some sports content or streaming content, it really does make the entire process very frustrating. Now, wouldn't it be amazing if we could make a single change on our device and through this change, you won't see any more adverts on any of these websites. Well, let me now make the change and we now see no adverts. So scrolling up and down, zero adverts, clicking on these links, again, no adverts. I can see the content there. I can scroll up and down to ensure there's no more video pop-ups. I can even refresh the page. Again, no advert pop-ups, no interruptions. I can now just simply click on the play button here. And in a couple of seconds, I can go ahead and enjoy that HD quality stream. So in this video today, let me show you how you can make this super easy change on your device and just ensure that you won't see any more adverts when you are browsing your favorite websites. All you need to do is just hit that like button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. So I'm gonna do my demonstration on the third generation Fire TV Q, but you can follow this process on any other Amazon device that allows you to run the Silk browser. You can even get the Silk browser for your Android TV devices, but you do have to sideload it. In fact, do leave me a comment below if you want to see a step-by-step -step install guide on how you can get the Silk browser onto your Android TV devices. Now, the reason why the Silk browser is very, very popular is because it really handles pop-ups well, because as you can imagine on these, uh, streaming sites there are just so many pop-ups every time you click on a link it tries to take you somewhere else but what the silk browser actually does is it prompts you saying this link is trying to take you somewhere else do you want to go there or do you want to stay where you are and in most cases you want to stay where you are so having this feature built in so your browser will stop your website trying to send you off to other locations other websites really makes silk one of the best browsers especially for streaming websites. Now to start the process, if we open up the browser and the first thing you want to do is press the context key, which is the one with the three lines. And we can now go to the menu here. Let's click on that. Now we can see some of the websites I was previously testing, but if you keep scrolling down and what you're looking for here is where it says settings. Let's click on that. Keep scrolling down and you're now looking for the option privacy and security. Let's click on that. So the first thing we're going to turn on is safe browsing. And this just means that any websites that are classified as hosting malware or potentially malicious content, they will be automatically blocked on your Fire Stick or your Amazon device. So let's turn the option on. Once you've done that, I also like to turn on the option do not track. And this will basically just reduce the amount that websites can track you as you browse or navigate through different websites. Let's go back. But the key thing we're looking for here is, is where it says use secure DNS. So let me click on that and I'm gonna turn that option on. Now, super quick summary about this. So the way websites work is your machine will try to connect to a website, like for example, techdoctoruk.com. But before it can connect to that website, it will ask my DNS server, my domain name server, what is the IP address for techdoctoruk.com? And it will then get an IP address, which it will then connect to. Now there are specialist DNS servers out there which are designed to block all adverts. So anytime they get a request for a domain that is known for serving adverts, they just block that request. So what we want to do is click here where it says choose another provider. And we're now going to add in a custom URL, which is again, a special URL designed specifically to block all adverts. 
Now the address, and you have to type this in correctly, otherwise you will get an error or you may even see a warning in red. So the address is HTTPS. I'm not going to edit this one. Make sure you guys can follow along and ensure that you type this in correctly. So HTTPS. Let's now add the colon. Let's do two forward slashes. Let's now type in DNS. Dot add God. So add God hyphen DNS dot com and the last bit is again one more forward slash and we now type in dns hyphen query and guys you do need to pause the video let me get to the end you can then pause it and just make sure that you have the exact same entry that i have so dns query that's it so once again https colon double forward slash dns.adguard-dns.com forward slash dns query. Now when you click on next, we can see there's no errors. And if there was a typo, in fact, let me just do a super quick typo. So let's say for example, you'd put a Z at the end by mistake. When you click on next, we can see we get an error telling us that please verify that this is a valid provider for those DNS queries. So let's quickly remove the typo. Let's just delete one letter, click on next. We can see the error has now gone. I can now press back, back again, back one more time. And that's pretty much it guys. Now, anytime I access any website, my favorite streaming websites or any websites, the minute those websites try to serve adverts, they'll be blocked by those ad guard DNS servers. So if I try this website here, which is just really bad for adverts. And we can see now guys, no adverts so far. If I click on one of these links, I click on stay here. Let's click on that one more time. We're now on the page. I can now scroll down. We can see zero adverts, no pop-ups, no more video pop-ups, and some of them can be inappropriate as well. So this way we can see with this change, I'm not seeing any adverts. I can now just click on this play button here. And in a couple of seconds, we are now streaming that super HD content and that's working flawlessly guys. Guys before I forget let me just share this amazing offer which is only available for the next two weeks whereby you can get complete protection for all of your devices, all of your fire sticks, all of your Android TVs, Windows, laptops, phones, everything covered with maximum protection, change your IP address, hide your online activity, access geolocked content, and to get all of that for under $3 a month, I definitely think you want to take up this special offer. Do have a look in the video description and pinned comment. Thank you.